Welcome back. We're playing today at long last. It's been six months somehow already. Has it been six months it's since we played this game? It's been six months and 999, it's yeah. Still I, gave, felt, I gave you time to recover, and I figured we'd do it when you were ready, but then you were, weren't saying you were ready ever, and then you said you are going to move. So I'm like, well, we better get this going now. <laughs> So, I, I'll never be Time ready. to play Zero Escape, Virtue's Last Reward. Okay. We're looking at the cover, just because it's larger than the fucking launcher we had access to in here. Uh, that was tiny. No, Where is launcher? Right that. There. I just want to look at the characters here, because it's it's curious? <laughs> what? what? <laughs> also, first of all, am I crazy, or is Wait. the guy in the front on the left the same guy that's on the front on the right, but his hair just looks white for some reason? That's weird, right? Yeah, I am more concerned about the fact that like the mummy has bigger boobs than white hair girl's head. So we're we're assuming like, that the girl, yeah, we're assuming that that's the mummy from the first game. It right? is the mummy the, from the credits or whatever. I mean, look at those <clears throat> boobies. Those are mummy boobies. Like three things immediately stand out, which is that that seems to be the mummy from the end of the first game. Yeah, that might be older Junpei or something. I don't know. I seriously it's, think it's like I, his son or something. Maybe it I don't can't know. Can't be Junpei. Depends on when the time. Junpei didn't get ripped. Like, but he how much survived the notary games and get ripped? Like, he, he could have. Why not? He's he's an anime character. <laughs> That's stupid. <laughs> I mean, admittedly, Ichigo did mad shit and somehow never got ripped in all of Bleach. But, yeah, exactly. <laughs> but like he might have gotten ripped. I don't know. And I also, mean, we have like gender bent Santa. We have gender bent Santa. That's absolutely we have, what it looks like, right? But we have like sexy Clover, which I don't, I don't feel comfortable with because Clover's already a child. I don't really. Do you think that's Clover? That could be Clover. That can't be Clover. Another pink haired girl, but just a bit older. Which is everyone might be just that bit older. It might isn't, be this... isn't this just everyone's kids? Didn't they just I don't do know. The, I thought they just did the. Uh, what if the... that actually is the mummy, and that's actually Junpei, and it's actually Clover? No, I think that that's not the mummy. Older. I think that's Lotus's kid. I think this is, these are all. Do kids. you think? Oh, like that so looks you think like that seven. These are, do you think these are all going to be the kids that escaped in the like pre the the backstory of the for, of original game? Oh, that's a good idea. I didn't think about that. Wait, how is a robot in there? Because yeah, that's, <laughs> who's the robot? <laughs> that's what I, I'm really confused about the robot. I, that's I not. Think... And then you got a redhead in a maid costume, and you got. Okay, it really looks like they reused the same character designs, right? Well, they reused the same character designer. Like that, that <laughs> like, like yeah. that, that snake, right? It is snake. I mean, it's just <laughs> that's a, like it's a snake like and drug... Chris Angel like had a baby. <laughs> <laughs> like... That, no, that's a uh, that's a uh, that's smoke a lot of weed snake. Like that's smoke a very lot of that's weed very loose snake. snake. Who's the old grandpa? I that's I don't know, but he looks like a badass, right? Is that like Ace when he was younger? I'm really con I'm consumed about the <laughs> helicopter hat or whatever. Helicopter hat. What I don't know the hat. Are you talking the about hat? I can't make sense of. It's a helmet. It's like an explorer I helmet you, crossed with like, headphones, crossed with like a crazy strap. They're like two TV screens. I, I feel like he's gonna shoot guns out of his ears. Pew pew. Maybe he's a Gundam. <laughs> he, he looks like a Gundam. Maybe he's just a Gundam. What is she? What is gender bent Snow sit, sitting on? Uh, air. Or... Whoa! How tall is the mummy? The mummy is like super tall. Look, that's her feet down Jesus there. Christ. Holy crap! She's taller than like main character. There's some perspective stuff going on here. All right, so we're going to play, at long last, Zero Escape. I'm not. Some of you have been, been anticipating this, and some of you have not. Uh, some of you have not. Have you Proceed guys at your own Wait, discretion, I is, guess. Is Zero back again? Some. I mean, I assume so. It's called Zero Escape. But isn't that just Santa? Maybe this time all the people are trying to trap Zero, and Zero has to get over. <laughs> but Zero is Santa. <laughs> or Why not. They why would they some, try to trap Santa? some people say zero is June. Some people say it's Santa. Some people uh, say the last second it was revealed to secretly be seven the whole time. And I'm like, what? Yeah, it's. I don't. If it sounds infuriating, it's because it is. Does that guy have an X Men symbol and an anarchy symbol on his body at the same time? Da -na 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 -na, bring down the government. Da -na 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 -na, well, you gotta, the you gotta pick Xavier or Magneto. You can't <laughs> just get both. He also has a grenade on his shoulder and then a naked lady on the other one. So I don't. I think he's just kind of toting the line here. I guess he's a car mechanic or something. He's a. I thought he was a NASCAR yeah, racer. Yeah. Oh, we should guess what their jobs are, right? Uh. Because everyone had like a job. Pink hair is a stripper. White hair is a stripper. <laughs> Mummy is a stripper. Uh. <laughs> robot guy is I don't know like the first sentient robot on the planet, bringing <laughs> world peace to. Human. Oh, he's wearing like a robe. Yeah, he's a monk. He looks like that uh, that Overwatch character. Yeah, he looks like Zenyatta. Yeah, he even has the same with hand the, as the Zenyatta and shit. It's. I think he's just a monk. Um, <laughs> I think the old guy's like a Native American. I don't know. 
It's like a safari kid or something. Safari kid? I don't know what to make. Safari. I don't. Honestly, I think like the kid is probably like some kind of genius tinker, the one with the hat. I think it's like some kind of inventor character. Like the character's like, I'm good with electronics, is like the kid with a fucking TV on his head. Um, I, I think the maid <laughs> he, is he like. He might be the nerd. I think the maid is just like collateral damage. <laughs> I think you mean she, you mean like how Lotus was in the last game for no reason? Yeah, I think and she, she didn't. Just, she just served no purpose. I think she's like someone who cleaned the facility, and they just put a watch on her. And they're like, "We need to fill the ranks." I'm curious to figure out what this is. Either she is the mummy, or she's Lotus's daughter. It, it could go either way. I want to say Lotus's daughter. That's a just big because... time skip if it's Lotus's daughter. No. Yeah. What if Zero is actually Lotus, and she's mad about being involved in the whole last game, so she's taking her revenge? <laughs> They, that would be fun. Uh, I just prayed this Wait, game. Wait, who are they taking revenge on? I don't know. Didn't we already take care of the person that caused the problem? I'm just going to pray that this game is somehow like a satisfying mystery this time. We'll see I'm, how it goes. I will never be satisfied. <laughs> I don't know if you know. Ah, 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 what? What? Right. That was a little loud. It's what was turn, that? It turned down a little more. What was that rabbit, it's though? It's a rabbit. It's fine. No. It's fine. Ah! It's Where is this place? Jumpy. Why did I know that? Wait, why is our love... Is that our love... Our love interest this Wait, time? Wait, one of those hands was fucking a robot. Ambidex edition. Whoa! 3D. 3D is not as nice as I thought it was going to be. <laughs> Wait, okay, what's... what's <laughs> Wait, hold on. Okay, memento mori. Uh, okay, I'm trying to figure out all the clues. Prisoner's Dilemma. Yeah, oh, just got to screenshot every single one of these moments and back, do them. And doors and knives and dead people and oh my god. <laughs> Spoilers, everyone dies in that room. <laughs> and the, and Mars. Alright. Choices you make in the future influence the past? In the past, didn't this stuff... Wait, I thought the past influenced the future. Both. Didn't the, didn't this intro spoil the shit out of the game last time? Yeah. Grandpa! Someone's, uh, that's, Someone someone's had a grandpa. gun. They got someone's grandpa. They got again. These, uh, these nine. Got a lot Don't more. worry though. That's not an actually nine. It's a uh, what's the Japanese word? Okay, that is literally a robot. That's a robot. It's literally a robot. Can the robot die too? I no. If the robot, does well, the robot you choose to ally or to betray? Did can we just? Can we all succeed? Did the robot swallow a bomb? <laughs> Wait, yeah, maybe. Like, <laughs> what is that? Maybe, like, are the bombs back? Wait, why back? is this all pixelated? What's pixelated? The, the bars. Uh, because it was made for the Vita. But this shouldn't look like pixels when the text is, like, clear and crisp. No, I think it was just always made as pixel art. Uh, like, it was always just a little pixely bit, but the text was always a font. Oh, okay. So when you scale it up, it's still the same. Uh -huh. English, Spoken skip text language. off. Cursor speed, yeah. Uh, probably turn isn't, that void. Isn't that obvious? <laughs> wow, rude. Isn't that, isn't that, isn't that, isn't that, isn't that, isn't that obvious? Drop the bass! Boom, 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 It's Japanese! Come on, girl, you can't be talking Japanese when we have English. Isn't that obvious? Isn't, 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 isn't that obvious? I don't know why this is so funny to me, but it's weird. Alright, well. Ah, it's going on a trip. Alright, it's fine. It's fine, everything's fine. Yeah, the voices are nice and easy to hear now. Hooray. Okay. Eh, eh, eh. Oops. Press B. That's doing the thing where the joystick skips around like a lunatic sometimes. Just press B. Uh, before it gets you're right. I, can't, I was trying to scroll to it and I no, can't. It's no. impossible. Just press B. Alright. There might be some weird screen stuff again, because much like the DS for, uh, 999 on the DS, this is also a touchscreen platform that it was made for. Oh. So, uh, probably fixed by scrolling a uh, thing around all the time. I hate probably that, gonna be fine. Though. This is Virtue's last reward. I hope it's good. Do we need to play with the <laughs> they controller? have a chance to start over. What? No, that's fine. So I say, mean, did we need to play with the controller? Because last time we were doing it because we were on a couch, but this time we, you have the key. Like, yeah, mouse. I could try using it. Well, I think you, you picked the gamepad one. You're committed to it now. You can't stop me. You can't defeat me. My power. Oh, I guess it does. Well, now all the buttons are going to be in. That's fine. Start from the beginning. This is, game is a work of fiction. Oh, Surprise. wait. It is? I don't want to play it then. Oh, yeah, I don't, care. I don't care about new truth 2028, stories. that's getting close! <laughs> it's ten years from now. Ow. Ow. Oh. What? Wait, what? <laughs> what was that camera angle? Wait, wait, what? Alright. You gas somebody in their car? That's kind of dangerous. 
Isn't that obvious? Ten. I assume obvious. Muscle Man is Sigma. Probably, yeah. I think. Uh, uh. Ow. Ow, 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 ow. <laughs> Damn it. Feels like my head's gonna explode. Wait. Seems familiar. I feel like we woke up this way before, before. Where the hell am I? Isn't that obvious? <laughs> Who's this grandpa on the elevator? <laughs> oh, it's oh. a creepy bunny. Looks like an elevator, bud. Isn't that obvious? Oh, okay. That's actually the first line of dialogue in the game. <laughs> <Wait. laughs> that could not have been funnier. <laughs> Keith, you asked me, was I ready to play 999 Zero Escape? No, I wasn't. I was not. I was not ready for this shit all over again. Oh, that's great. All right. Gah. Who the hell are you? Um, hello? Right, uh, okay. Uh, let's try a different tact here. Where the hell are we? Also, while we're at it, why? No response? You always this friendly, or did I kick you while I was sleeping? Damn. No luck there either, huh? I'm plenty friendly. Uh, okay. Do you want to delay? Are you the only character with no voice actor? What? Yeah, probably. I said I'm plenty friendly. Hey, looks like you can talk after all. So, let's try this again. Where are we? Don't know. Huh. Hmm. Well, could be worse, I guess. You could have said, actually, we're stuck in a booby-trapped elevator in bowels of a top-secret government facility where they conduct grotesque human experiments. Isn't that obvious? <laughs> right, back to the first question, then. Who are you? By which I mean, what's your name? This is weird. I don't like, I don't like the 3D thing. It, it's kind of weird. Sigma. Wait. Cute. That's my name. I'm asking you what... Wait a second. How do you know my name? I haven't met you before, have I? No, you haven't. I don't have any idea who you are. Uh... But... But what? How could you know my name if you don't have any idea who I am? How the hell am I supposed to know? I just you... know it, okay? Hey. No need to bite my head off. It's just you're not really making sense here. And you still haven't told me who you are. Shut up! Just uh... back off, Grandpa! <laughs> Grandpa? Look, I just don't know, alright? It's just kind of... there. Like... I looked at you, and some part of my brain just said, that's Sigma. Hold on a second. What do you think this thing is? Huh? This bracelet? Pair. It, it actually has a pairing mode? Interesting. So we have a new mechanic of how characters might interact with each other. Well, now we know how they, the they fake numbers kind of get pairs. Now we know where the intro says, like, who do you ally with and who do you betray? It's based on parry. Although, what if the plot twist is going to be once again like the last game? Psych, you were supposed to never betray anyone. You could have won the whole time. You're just assholes. Isn't that what it always is? I don't know. We'll see. See, you've got one too. They're pretty much identical. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Uh, they both say three? Where'd they come from? It was on already when I woke up. Oh, we're in groups already. Now. Yeah, probably. Oh. We've, been, we've been grouped into pairs. Gross. A marriage game. Well, it doesn't seem like it's a watch, does it? No. It's three past it's pair. It's just got a three and the word pair. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? Trying to get it off. Good luck. I spent a while trying to get mine off while you were napping. Thanks for Thought telling me. Tight. Doesn't even have a clasp or anything. 
That's what she said. What about these buttons on the sides? I pressed them, but nothing happened. <laughs> Not even a beep. Oh, looks like my watch. Hmm. Yeah, you're right. Nothing. Damn it! What the hell is going on here? Somebody better start explaining, or... Hey, look! What? There's something on that screen over there. Wait, what? <gasps> That's not the rabbit? Yeah. Oh, it's alive. How are you feeling? Uh, no! How do you like strange, like, geisha rabbit uh, Wait, thing? are we gonna do, like, the... Is this thing Ganropa, but with rabbits? Is this the cute animal that kills us in this anime? I think this is Zero. You think this is zero this time? I think so. It blinks. Wait, how does its face animate? I've got questions. Yeah, I don't think its face does animate. It just blinks and it makes mouth movements. But like how? Uh, in, I, what does it look like in-universe? I guess it would look like a Five Nights is at Freddy's character where it's like chunk 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 Are we supposed to think that it's a cartoon? Maybe, yeah. Maybe it's like Is soft? it a cartoon in-universe or like... Is there a puppet? But it can't be a puppet because its eyes are blinking like that. I mean, Jim like Henson that, puppets can blink. But that's not puppet eye blinking. That's like my face is an animated blinking. Well, look, there's a limitation on what the Vita can accomplish, yeah. accomplish here. I am Zero the Third, the king of this kingdom. Whoa, 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 wait, hold on. The third implies that there's two others. And where did they go? Also, what? Wait, you're Zero? Wait, you kidnapped everyone? A rabbit did? <laughs> no, he's a, he's a hand puppet. I don't... Okay, this is dumb already. Uh, wait, Zero the third? What? The, the third means that you're, like, actually related. Are you just Santa's kid? That's, Santa, what the fuck? That's an odd setup. What, what the hell is that? A rat? Um... <laughs> okay. All right, uh, well, let's not rely on her for puzzles. Yep, uh, you're, you just you explained that very clearly. Uh, no, pretty sure it's a rabbit. Are you listening? It listen? does seem silly to have a big old chit chat right now. So, I'm gonna give you a game to play! <laughs> a game? Yes, yes, yes! And I'm calling it the Nunnery Game! Do I have air horns? Ampidex edition? Just like. Like, yeah, I'm not like, sure what that is. Oh, she she knows, but she doesn't know it's a, does a she? rabbit. There's more to uh, it. Ah. Lots more. But if I told you now, that would be cheating. But would so, it? Hurry up and get out. I'll be waiting. I'll be honest. Uh, hey, hey hold on. Is explaining the story if, cheating? If uh, if I was told what the story of 999 was before we started 999, I still wouldn't have been able to beat the game <laughs> like like if, if someone if someone walked oh, up you like, mean like if you were a contestant and you knew everything about what was going to happen you yeah. still couldn't beat it like if zero was like okay let me tell you uh, straight straight facts you're doing a puzzle from the past but you must do it successfully so that you can save someone in the past in the future i would have been like i this doesn't explain how to beat the nonary game and he's like yeah but that's that's the plot i'm like what i'm just trying to figure out whether or not there's actually a rabbit that talks or not <laughs> I, I mean, it's wearing a hat, so yeah, it's probably real. It's a Chinese hat, too. <laughs> Who the hell? Uh, all right, I forgot to tell you the most important thing. This elevator you're in, it's gonna fall in a few minutes. Way down. Like, fall? Yes, indeedy. So you'd better get moving. I'll see you later. <laughs> Have this... a nice trick. Have a nice trick? See you, see you next fall. Shouldn't it be trip? No. Nah. Yeah? Uh huh. Y y yeah, see you next fall. <laughs> oh, he actually did that. Wow. I wasn't reading it when I said that. <laughs> and then it came up on the screen. Oh boy. I guess I didn't. That joke no wasn't any funnier in elementary school. So it's a mistype on the translation. She said, have a nice trip. But the, the yeah. subtitle said trick. Yeah, I don't know. That's a. Unless Japanese Unless people actually think that is that I don't know maybe some people say that I only have know a nice that trick I've only ever heard that joke in the first uh, Power Rangers movie <laughs> where, ah, Cam where ah. Kimber Kimberly kicks a putty soldier down, down the, the stairs, stairs and she's like have a nice trip yeah see you next fall. <laughs>
<laughs> They're fighting like a construction yard or something before the ooze shit happens. Oh man, that movie's programmed my brain in the worst way. Oh, right. I get it. Trip and trick, huh? What? Wait. What? Oh, so we can we can probably say hi to more of those not really translated puzzle uh, jokes from the first game that never worked. <laughs> And we're like, I don't get it, what they're saying. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Don't tell me you're impressed. Oh, for the love of... It's like we said, don't rely on her for puzzles. She can't identify rabbits. Huh. Damn it. Damn it. God damn it. This is damn it. <laughs> that stupid rabbit didn't tell us anything. Isn't it obvious? How are we even supposed to get out of here? Isn't it obvious? Oh, well, I guess whining about it isn't going to help anybody. Uh, we won't be able to get any answers if we can't get out of here. Have you tried opening the door? Have you tried- I don't think she's- I don't think he's tried yet. Have you tried pressing buttons? Remember that one time we were like, how do we open this door? And then we found out that walking up and opening it is how you open it. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> you with me? Come on, just nod or something. I don't want to die here any more than you. Hey. Let's go. Hey, you know what? Look. I'm gonna go ahead and point this out. I like that there's 3D models. Ah, seek a way out. I, I like new the screen. Version. New screen. Um, you you want you miss Junpei going whoa. Yeah. <laughs> Aww. This game consists of two sections: the escape portion and the novel portion. The goal of the escape portion is to escape from whatever room you're in. Hence the name. Huh? <laughs> Move the cursor with the left stick and press the A button to examine anything on the screen that catches your attention. You can change the camera angle by pressing LB or RB. Okay. So my understanding right now is that yes. we, uh, so last time there was like a novel mode and like a fast mode or whatever. Yeah. My understanding is that was only the first game, so it's gone now. Cool. So now it's just that we don't have to worry about whether or not we're missing shit by having to check something that's a well, way more tedious version. Technically, we can also see what's happening now. Where yeah. The first one we couldn't see because it was yeah. all static images. Isn't it obvious? Isn't it obvious? Well, touch the fire extinguisher because it's telling us how to use it and I'm going to use it. When you see the word zoom in cyan in the right corner of your screen, the game is in zoom mode. Oh, okay. <laughs> to return to the normal view from zoom mode, press the B button. Yeah, this is going to be weird. How do you What's right going to be weird? The, uh, the part where the cursor's not showing yeah, up. Yeah, just use the... It's yeah, fine. Just... There we go. I was about to, be, to say, like, my cursor's not showing up in the recording anyway. The yeah. mouse cursor. So let's just use controller. It's fine. Okay. It's fine. Um... What the hell is this thing? It's a stupid thing. It's huge. Earlier today, you couldn't even speak correctly, and then you volunteered to do, like, gruff voice for the entire playthrough. And you might be the only non-voice acted character in the game. <laughs> no, I make mistakes. Get ready for 20 plus hours of doing that. It'll be fine. Never mind. Oh. Is it an ATM? Hmm. Mm. I see. Then do you think this safe down here is stuffed with cash? That'd be nice. No, it wouldn't. We have bigger problems than money right now. Stop wanting money. <laughs> what a dick. It's like, what if it's stuffed with cash? That'd be nice. No, it wouldn't. <laughs> Like, I don't know, getting the hell out of here! Well, you don't have to yell about it. There's a strange, mysterious device on the far side of the elevator. What, the fire extinguisher? I think you can put things into these. Oh, they're key slots. There are three of them. I think they're probably for memory cards or some of some sort. <laughs> memory cards, that's cute. You didn't even know what a rabbit was. Yeah, I don't know. It could be memory cards, it could be credit, uh, ID cards. They're probably just like the... We'll, we'll know when we find any kind of card. <laughs> no, I was trying to leave. Oh, B, yeah. right. See, there's a fire extinguisher. Now it's, in, now it's in full 3D, Andrew. Oh my god. <gasps> oh, 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 whoa! I know where we are relative uh, to things. I love We're it. We're gonna be able to tell what the 3D space is instead of teleporting around. I like it. There were so many rooms in 999 where we would change the camera and go, like, how does the layout of this room work? Yes, there was <laughs> a we lot like, of times I felt that you way. Would, sometimes you'd rotate, and other times you would teleport and rotate. And yeah. Like, I can't tell where we are. I think the first time that happened was the, the casino room. Yes. Where, like, I can't tell. Casino where, room. I'm like, I'm pressing the bumpers, and I can't tell where it's taking me. Oh, wait, there's the fire. Wait, there's two fire. What do you think this means? Hell if I know. Just a bunch of pictures of babies and old people. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you see if you can get it off the wall? 
Well, we, wow, we took it. Okay. Okay. Some things you come across and collect won't be stored in the rest of your items. Instead, they'll be put in the file because they're garbage. Okay. <laughs> All right. Good to know that that's not important for the puzzle. You can press oh! the right directional button to go to the archive. No, go to file. Go look at that picture. The more right you now. know, part one, two, three. Okay, I don't care about all escapes that. and novels. No, <laughs> what no, is an escape? No. Go to file. I know uh, exactly what that picture go. is. That's a. That's a. Okay, hold on. One, two, three, what? wait, four, five, six. It, it looks seven. like that weird, that weird one, cartoon that was on Adult two, Swim. Three, four. The guy with butts. <laughs> wait, what counts as an old person? I'm gonna count. Oh, as do one, you think two, counting three, them is the four, answer? Four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four. Okay, yeah. So that's okay. So seven old people, four babies. Go back. Seven old people, four babies, and how many? Not, not neither. Life like, would be see, infinitely a... happier if we could only be born at the age of eighty and gradually approach eighteen. Oh, it says try counting the numbers of babies and old people. It yeah. actually says that explicitly on the screen. Oh, I didn't even see that. Okay. Well, <laughs> wait a minute. Um, what, wait, why are you giving that one away? Go B. Press B, and I'll tell you why. Now go to there it is right there on the elevator. Oh, there's so just because yeah. the old people sign. And the other side has a baby on. What it. was the number? Seven. Okay. Yes. Yes. We already figured out the puzzle. Uh -huh. Huh? Why did it light up? It didn't do anything earlier. Wait, what? Maybe that was because the game hadn't started yet. So you think this button does something? <laughs> That's what buttons do. To know. Let's take another look at it. I think uh, it's more of no, a lever. I really think it's more of a lever. Uh, and then the babies. There was four. And back. Yeah. Green, yellow. Red, blue. Uh, okay, well that's based on the elevator thing right Green, there. Green, yellow, red, blue. Yeah. Press huh. them. A triangular bolt. Can you take the caps off of the... Can you take the caps off of those bars? Maybe. <laughs> Why am I wow, telling you this? Can't you see it? <laughs> yeah, wait, can you take the ends of the... What does my right stick do? Why? Ah! Oh, that's my inventory. Ah. It's why. Oh, that in the middle of that circle will be the item I'm holding when I actually have one. Okay. This is a better interface, generally, I think. Yeah? Can you? Yeah, can you take that off? So why are these colored like this? Oh. Hey, this end is loose. Can you take it off? Let's see. I bet it matches the one. Maybe. Handle green. Probably the handle for some kind of tool. The grip is green. Green. Oh no, an item appeared on the screen. You can inspect the items or not do anything with them. To access the item, press Y. The item icon will show whenever you're currently holding. Oh. Yep, and then go grab Let's the other using ones. on the green one. Yeah, sure. Okay. Can you just press it? Yeah, it the is. The handle you've got the same color as that bolt. Yeah. Well, okay, that's good. What are you planning to do with it? Take the bolt off, of course. What? With just the handle? Uh. Are you sure about this? Uh. Wait, there's more parts that go to it? Maybe. Let's just grab all the things. I guess. Do -do 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 -do. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, yeah. It's the, they're the same. Weird. Yeah, maybe they combine. Transformers more than <laughs> meets the eye. Trans oh, you cannot combine no, these items. You cannot. All right, well, let's steal the other ones. Steal the other ones. Fine. Oh, great. I'd be perfectly happy if this game was, like, significantly larger percentage of the playthrough was this. I would be... Grateful. I like this part. Less more. Like less talking, more puzzles. All right, so we got the four handles. You okay. You found the baby part out fast. Yeah. All right. Fire extinguisher directions. Pull the pin. Wait. Pull the key out and put it in the lock hole. So the fire extinguisher has a key in it. So when you go to the fire extinguisher and no, we don't have the key. This looks like a case for a fire extinguisher. What a fucking genius over here. <laughs> Let me see if I can open it. Did you read the sign Damn. we just read together? No good. Is it locked? Looks that way, yeah. Go so back, go so to the fire extinguisher. Based on how bad she was at identifying rabbits, her confirming it being a fire extinguisher makes me less certain that it's a fire extinguisher. <laughs> yeah. Um, so there's a the fire extinguisher. Ooh, oh. There's a safe down here. A square metal box. Looks like a safe. Yeah. 
I wonder what's inside. Something someone wants to keep safe. What else would you put in a safe? Thanks. <laughs> oh, what do you think it could be? A cracker? What the hell's so important about a cracker? Okay. How about a tie deposit box? A, a what? what? What does that even mean? Let's just try and open it. How? Well, there's some kind of pad on the front with a 3x3 three three grid, right? I'm guessing that's how you open it. Uh, right. Let's give it a shot, then. Each escape room has a safe somewhere. <laughs> These what? safes have two passwords, one for escaping and one for a hidden file. Every, every room has a safe? Apparently. When you open the safe using the escape password, you'll get a key that will allow you to leave the room you're in. Okay. When you open the safe with the hidden file password in hard mode, you'll get a gold file. If you do it in easy mode, you'll get a silver file instead. Okay. What difficulty are we on? Didn't we just start? Yeah. What? Yeah. <laughs> the gold and silver files contain supplementary facts and background information that will give the novel sections added depth, but are not necessary for escaping. Great. Star in order to escape and continue the game. You must open the safe with the escape password. Okay. Oh, well, the we star. Don't I was supposed to read the star. I thought it was like, this is a symbol that's important, like, yeah. like a lot of games do. It's just an asterisk. Like, yeah. Like, note, note, note. Uh, oh, there's a lot. I was going to say, like, couldn't you just brute force these relatively easily if it's just this small of a grid? But no. there's, like, there's like special symbols. Yeah. So that would take a while. We don't have anything in the memo yet, right? Yeah. No. Do I draw on the memo? Yeah. Oh! That's cool. Look at that. That's handy. Wait, right. go back to memo. Is it there? I think so. Yeah. That's. that's cool. I just press Y and it'll go away. We really trash it. You can also make multiple pages. I oh, think. Oh, like I bet you can. Bumpers. I bet you'll find like pages that have the answer, and you could just draw the answers. Could be, and then you can bring it over the screen yeah. to overlay it. That's a cool idea. That's a smart idea. Archive poster in the elevator. I already figured that one out. Yep. The more you know. Should we check those? No. Uh, we don't need help. Oh my goodness. We've been here before. What difficulty are we on? Normal. Save? Oh, is it the save button? Yeah. It is. Damn. No luck. Well, of course not. You're not going to get far just guessing. We need to find a clue. I was in an escape room where somebody actually just guessed how to open a lock. It was a problem. <laughs> Because then we were like, fuck, which puzzles lead to that or not? So we'd solve a thing and we didn't know if the thing we got as a result was useful or not. Because yeah. we're like, Dude, was that just the thing that led to the lock you already opened or what? It, 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 guessing a password on accident actually fucks you up. Oh, look, that's where the key is. Yep. Fire extinguisher. What's something like this doing in an elevator? Case of a fire? I feel like you're about to talk to me about memes because you're Solid Snake. Oh, Isn't that God. obvious? It's here in case there's a fire. God damn it. Whoa, you're saying that there's some sort of thing in here that'll start a fire? Not out of the question. Come on, don't do that. I won't be able to do anything if I think there's something in here that will set us on fire. You just use the extinguisher, right? Yeah. Key. Pull the key, please. Thank you. I've got a key and a lot of these things. Yeah, I got a lot of handles. Yeah, a lot of handles. Do you have a handle in this situation, Keith? I wonder if we could bash this door down with the fire extinguisher. I think I'll let you try that. It's probably full of explosives. The only thing that's going to get extinguished is you. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> the only thing in this room getting extinguished is you. <laughs> hey, come on now, that's scary. Wait, you, does she think that the... Wait, which thing? The she door? She thinks the fire extinguisher is like... Extinguisher? Full of explosives. Full of explosives? I guess. That's a hell of a leap to go through. Yeah. She's really adapted to this being a death game already. I, we don't even know if it's a death game. All right, let's see. If this pin can open the lock. This Oink. pin? Isn't a key? All right. Hmm. Looks like it worked. Excellent. <laughs> He's really into this. Okay. Time to see what's inside. Oh. Uh. <laughs> I don't think a place to put all the handles is what I was expecting. No. The handles are the key. <laughs> this is stupid. What's this? <laughs> Polyurethane packaging? Polyurethane. You're a polyurethane. There's a few pieces of metal in there. Four of them. I wonder what they connect to. They look like sockets for socket wrenches. Each one has a different shape, though. Yeah. Well, we might as well take them. 
Oh, we just took da, it. Da, da, da. Wait, all of them Only or one, just though. the triangle tip? Wait. Up. Oh, okay. All. Okay. 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 Well, all of them. that's okay. gonna become a very large item window, item circle, well, isn't it? Go. No, because we're combining all of them immediately. What were those like old PS One games that had like a giant? Your all of your inventory. <gasps> Tomb Raider. Yeah. Your, your inventory was a giant circle of items you had to slowly scroll through yeah. from that perspective. Yeah, I was like, I played it at some point. I played it, but something I'd never played since. So go ahead and I Zoom guess on here. Fix so yellow, so yellow is triangle. I, yeah. So here I can see it. Yeah. Here so yellow. All right. Uh, hexagon, pentagon, square, triangle. Ta-da! Hexagon, oh, that's red. pentagon is green. Pentagon. That's a pentagon socket. Yeah. Okay. I'm looking at it. Oh, okay. Blue is square. I can drift around with balls and Oh, is ooh. hexagon. Yep, we did it. That da, was da, easy da, puzzle. Da. And now we can unlock them as we know. Nope. Yeah. Excellent. That's the Red Bull God. It's fucking dumb. All right, let's just give this yellow one a twist. You have to say something every time. Why does the handle have to match? All right. You, you wondering about that? Yeah. Why does the handle have to match the socket? That's the green bolt off. Because all their ends look the same, right? Maybe they won't come off. They're the color coordinated. Maybe yeah. like. Good they... job. You're a regular mechanic. You need to dress like a mechanic. He is a mechanic. As far as we can tell, he. We don't. That's not confirmed yet, is it? No. He was just in a car. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Looks like you got it off. Right. So I've got all the bolts off now. Ready. I'm gonna open it. What are you asking me for? Okay, okay, jeez. Huh? What is this? Hello. Oh, uh, wait. Fuck. There are a number of mini games you will play during an escape. Thanks. This, do we are you are we immediately playing Sokoban? Mm. Controls and rules would generally be given to you before the mini game begins, but some start without giving you detailed instructions. Mm. If you can't solve a minigame, try to quit by pressing back button on the bottom right corner of the minigame screen. Okay. If you keep trying, though, the other characters might start to give you hints. <laughs> Great! <laughs> I mean, I'm glad that they'll help. You'll they'll only they'll do this, only when, do you this when you're playing in easy mode, though. Okay. Remember, if you get stuck in a minigame, try uh, give it several tries before you switch the difficulty to easy. Oh, so oh, maybe we're on hard already. We're on hard by default. I would hope we're on hard, because what the fuck? <laughs> I don't want to play it on the easy first or anything. What's this? What's this? It looks like some kind of maze. Do you think we're supposed to solve this? Probably. All right. <laughs> I'm on it. You need to move the green block from the top left of the, uh, to the blue square on the bottom right. You can move the green and red blocks up and down as well as the sideways by using the directional buttons. Oh. So just make a path for it to get there. Oh. 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 Okay. You hold A, then press a direction, and then everything slides as a result. That's not cool. Wait. What is it? Hmm. Okay, okay. Go. Oh, okay. Yeah. Up. No. No. Up. Yeah. No. There you go. Nailed it. Wait. Next Over part is going to be interesting. Oh, to, I'm sorry. To the left. Oh, I have a map. Huh? Yeah, to the left. Now to the left. Is that just gonna get stuck? Oh yeah, yeah. I have one more to deal with. Oh Shit. no no, you're fine. You're fine. Go back. Go back to the. Go back to the left, and then go up. You're right. Okay. Yep. Completed. Completed. Oh. Sweet. How did it switch? Was there like another floor? I did it. <laughs> He's really into this. He is actually. <laughs> I'm, I'm glad someone's enthusiastic because <laughs> Jinpei wasn't. You're pretty good. <laughs> this is this is kid stuff. I can do it with my eyes closed. Oh, look at this. Mm -hmm. That's what she said. Something came out of the box. Oh yeah. Is this a memory card? Oh yeah, we got a green card. Wait, it's like literally a PlayStation memory card. Kinda, yeah. It's really flat. Oh, oh no, no, wait. No, it's uh like it's a, a camera it's, memory card. Yeah. Whatever you, whatever you call those. Yeah, I've only, so I've only, I've only had them on digital cameras. Oh, yeah. Did you use these on Vitas? Yeah, you did. My poor Vita got so little lifespan because they... Sony killed it. <laughs> Sony murdered the fuck out of it. I've got a green memory card in my hand. 
Let's see what happens when I put it in. <laughs> Let's see what happens when I put it in. Hey, it turned on! <laughs> <laughs> the idea which this character to an idiot like it's a bumbling like he's gonna figure out all the puzzles but he's gonna be shocked every time by like this he's not even an idiot he's just so excited yeah childlike wonder yeah he's like doesn't even know it's an escape a death game looks like this thing is working now screen is glowing with a strange light all right oh we got half of it Wait, so wait, there's still more puzzle to do for two more memory cards. What are the rest of them? Evidently. Well, and th these never did anything. The signs. I assume our numbers are wrong. Because nothing happened. Wait a second. Unless that was required to make the handles come off. Maybe it was. Maybe it was. But there's nothing else to do Four, in this place. Four. Huh? Seven. Yeah, I would, I would, uh, double check. I would say this double check. Double check it. I, th I thought I was right. Oh, there the it is. The flow chart is back. You want to see what it looks like? Yeah. I don't think. Wait, you want to get this done before I left? What's that? You want to get this done before I left? I don't think we're <laughs> we going to get to the we third game. We have like game. six months. We can do this. Are you sure? <laughs> we can do this. I mean, it's very linear, at least. Once you go down one path, you're set it's, in that uh, path. It has some pretty set branches going on here. Holy shit. Yeah, there's no part where it loops back on itself like no. the first game did. Where it's like, psych, this also goes to the boat ending or submarine ending. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, log? What's that? Oh, that's cross messages. Oh, good. Good to know it's there, I guess. Speed up. So we are on hard, by the way. It says that it says, yeah, it, says it's it there. Hard. Try counting the number of babies and old people. There is one, two, three, and four babies. There are one, two, three, four five, six old people. Seven old people. Am I wrong? I think I see seven old people. And you said four babies? Yes. One, two, three, four. There's four babies. There's like seven children. If we count the, the older people. What if we... Wait a second. Like, there are pretty clearly, like, four baby babies. What if... Hold on. But hold there's, like, phone. two adults and three children, I think? You think we should add those? Wait, what if we did... Real people? And... I don't know about the baby. What if we did three old people and... Yeah, and keep the four babies. Try three old people. Three old people? Three Why old three? Because they're three old people with canes. And the thing, the picture was about canes. What was about canes? The picture, I don't know. What are you talking well, about? Well, it also says, like, life would be infinitely happier if we could be born at age 80 and gradually approach 18. But that makes no sense, because there's no 18-year-olds on this page. Unless the hooker's 18. But <laughs> Unless the hooker's um, 18. So, like... Okay. Well, I mean, the number's still the same. Seven and four. Try... I don't know. We could try inverting them. Because, see? Yeah, we could try inverting them. Four and then seven, I guess? Is this a subversion? Yeah, yeah, yes, yes, yes. <laughs> no? Try putting... Okay, now just count down from three. Or from four. We might count down. Or put three for the old people. Three for the old people? Yeah, put three for the old people. Okay. Why? That's how many canes there are. But the babies just keep going down. I don't think that's accurate. I don't think the cane is the point. I think it's just saying old people. What's this one? Rabbit. How many rabbits there are? I don't know. Um. Button? There's a little panel here with a keyhole. The opening in the center is covered with a transparent plastic, which is clearly going to be the button to get us out of there. Yeah, could um, be. We need a key for that. Light doesn't work. Display. Right. There are numbers Just put here. Zero. Oh wait, seven, eight. Bunny ears too. <laughs> There's a slot. What's the deal with this. What's the deal with this slit? You mean slot, right? Yeah, that is slit is very sexual. They're the same thing. What does it matter what we call it? 
It's a hole to put cards into. We don't know things go into it. Oh. Uh -huh. Yeah, it's where one of the cards come from that we need. What about zero? Just press zero. Just press zero. No oh, because the rabbit picture. is zero. No. Uh -oh. oh well, that was that was reasonably clever. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. No. Nope. Okay. Are there rabbits on here? <laughs> Maybe there is. I didn't. I don't think I see one. Is the hooker a rabbit? Um. Yeah, I don't know. I really don't know what this want. Wait, wait. Seven. Wait, go back to the elevator. Press three. What if we minus them? How many old people versus how many babies and, and subtract? Is there a way of determining what age these people are? No. That's why I thought too. I, so thought I partly like wonder what if we draw a line between all of them based on like descending age? Yeah. And then like maybe it'd be shaped like something. But that'd Penis. be pretty advanced for the first room though. Press, uh, yeah, you know, put it back. Put it, put the elevator thing back to what it was. So seven, four. So seven for the old people, four for the babies. Hey, Sigma. Did you hear a noise? What noise? Um, I think it was over here somewhere. Oh. I think all we had to do was put zero in. That's how close we were. <laughs> like... We had seven and four and yeah, we just yeah. had to put zero in for the rabbit. Damn it. Okay, that makes way more sense. Well, at least we figured I get it, it out. Okay, it's a lot better than my idea. Yeah, glad we could cur <laughs> we could curtail that. <laughs> I've got a blue memory card in my hand. Let's see what happens when I put it in. Oh baby, what the heck is this? <laughs> Maybe it's some kind of password? A password? You got a notepad or something? Uh, no, not really. Then you'll just have to remember this. You think you can handle that? Y yeah of course! I'm always remembering shit! <laughs> okay, that's his, that's his writing. You found an escape password. To view it, press the right directional pad into the archive. What? Got it. Go to the no. Go to the directional. Go to the what? archive first. Well, I was gonna go to it first. So we have to type it in here. Why is it saying all this again? Yeah, go why is away. It this? Oh, the archive's also here. Oh, safe elevator. <laughs> okay. Wait, can you touch the other side? I think that's the password you don't have yet. Go to memo. Uh oh, wait. This is for writing on it. If you useful. want to write on it. This isn't very useful. It's useful if you want to like have some sort of input. No, no, I'm saying I was trying to match it up to the safe combination, but it's not. Very oh, wait, no, you can still do it. So where your thing is right now. Yeah, that's where it would be on the safe. I mean, I can remember it fine. I can just type it in myself. No. Yeah, sun, moon, star. It's easy. Oh. I'm upset. Wait, we didn't no, you fool. What? We needed the other one for hard mode, remember? It's just gonna give us a key. We don't have to use it. I assume. We had to manually leave the room every time in the last game, didn't we? Huh. That's it! You did it! Don't patronize. Good me. job. <laughs> Piece of cake! Is this a key? But uh, uh, uh. Well, I remember it said hard mode. We need to find like the fancy. Hey, files. it is a key. We found it. Awesome. Now hurry up and use it. Nah. Yeah, remember it said we needed to. Oh, so now we need to find the red card. Yeah. And then we need to find the red card. How? Because yeah, hard mode gives us special documents. But in the last game, we had to manually leave the room. So as far as I know, we don't have to like. So go to the elevator the thing? Good, we don't have to avoid the other key go necessarily. Go to the elevator? No, no. Uh, and press three. Yeah, press three? Yeah, press three. Yeah, I was right! Is it the number? Yeah, subtraction. You just subtract the uh, the babies and the old people. <laughs> yeah! That's what I was going to do before. It still would have given us something. Yeah! Jesus Christ. All right. There it is again. It's right there. Wow. You nailed it, apparently. Da -na -na -na. <laughs> I'm the best. The fuck? <laughs> no, no, what do you no, It's fine. Calm down. I'm I gotta I've got a red memory card in my hand. Oh my god. 
Let's see what happens when I put it in. <laughs> He's so into it. Huh? Star, star, moon. This isn't what it showed us last time. <laughs> okay, he's an idiot. <laughs> huh? A different password? I guess they didn't get the tutorial, so they don't know about the golden documents or hard mode, because they're Wait, humans. They, who's reading these, then? It's just they're telling us as the player to do stuff, and then the characters don't know, so they're just doing stuff for no reason. Oh, we know! <laughs> stop! Do this every time. We picked hard mode! I think it'll stop telling us that after the first time. Yeah. After the first level. Star, star, moon. Yeah, star, star, moon. All right, fine. We yeah. did it, Andrew. And we're Completed. getting a ghost star at the end of this. Oh, Where'd yeah, that... baby. Where'd that come from? Huh? Where'd that come from? That's odd. It opened with this password, too. It switched. Hmm, the maybe... back door is a swivel. Oh, yeah, the circle on the yeah. bottom. Maybe there's two types of passwords. Look. It has different stuff in it now. Yeah, yeah, you're right. It's got a false back. See? I can just flip it around. You got a false back. Kind of like those hidden passages in mansions and stuff. So if you put in a different password, you get a diff you get different stuff. I think so. Uh. Right, well, that's enough of that. Grab the stuff. Yeah, let's just get out of here. I'm amused that we committed to doing that, even though we knew that the elevator's gonna fall and kill us. Yeah. You found a gold file! Good job. Go to that archive. Yeah, well, I want to see that, because we worked really hard on that. We earned it. <gasps> Whoa. What? What is all this? So, what is all this? Why is there so many now? Oh my god. There's 16 pages. Wait, are we gonna get 16 golden files in total? Because I ain't got Do you that. think the first page is all of the ones that we just oh got? Oh my sweet god. What is all this? Quantum computer? Alright, so AB room. This is where you play the AB game. It appears in the elevator car. There are six AB rooms in the warehouse on floor A. From the left, they're referred to as one, two, three, four. What? Are, the interior of the room is identical to the others. With a voting device in the wall and a hatch, and a hatch in the ceiling. There's a vote. That's a voting device? Okay. <gasps> oh, God. Are we We're voting off people dies? out? Oh, Jesus. Oh, this is going to be important for the rest of the game. Okay. Ooh. Good thing we got this. Ooh, it's like Lost Dimension. Or like Lost. What? No. Or just lost. You mean survivor? Or survivor. I'm like, lost doesn't have voting people off the island. <laughs> well, some people get off the island. <laughs> they didn't vote them out. Maybe. No, I, I just finished playing a game called Lost Survivor recently where you, uh, you, there's like, somebody in this group's a traitor, and you try to vote out who you think the traitor is, and they get executed. <laughs> Basically, Witch Hunt Salem and yeah, all the other games like that. Yeah, but it was a JRPG with tactical combat, so it was weird that because you, you're voting out your playable characters. A B game? This refers to the door of the A B room. Most elevator doors open horizontally, but this one opens and closes vertically. Most elevators also include a safety feature that prevents the door from closing if anything obstructs it. These doors have no such safety feature. I bet that when you vote somebody out, their elevator falls. Jesus. <laughs> That's how they die? That's it just, a little extreme. It just drops their elevator and they die. Bracelet one. Each participant has a bracelet attached to their left wrist. If a participant breaks the rules or fails to fulfill certain conditions, then a set of four needles in the bracelet will inject them with two chemicals in succession. Oh. There are only two uh, situ situations which will cause the bracelet to come off. The person wearing it com uh, completes the game and escapes, or the heart of the person wearing it stops beating. Attempting to break the bracelet or attempting to force it off will be considered a violation of the rules. Okay, so instead of a bomb, which was really hard to accept anyway, now it just poisons you. <laughs> That's better. I can believe that. A1. AI? AI is short for artificial insemination. What? <laughs> are you injecting me with babies? Which is a process by which eggs are fertilized without the use of male organ. It is commonly used in the breeding of dairy cattle and pigs, but it also has been... Oh, I'm being told that in this case, AI stands for artificial intelligence, which is another thing entirely. Oh, that's what I expected. Okay. okay. So it was but a, it didn't explain artificial the, intelligence. The entire entry was a joke? Yes. I was not expect, expecting the penisless semen injector to be whatever. Have a nice circle, circle, circle one. Day equals one. Is that a code we need to know? Oh. What if it's a password? Maybe. Or, uh, word zero three says before he leaves. There are a few variations. Have a nice trick. Have a nice trap. Have a nice trader. What? Oh. Trick, trap, trader. Oh, so someone was keeping a log of the kind of different things that the rabbit Evidently. would say. Evidently. I'm not sure who. Quantum computer. 
A device built by Tom Quan, a boys, uh, a Boise, Ohio commuter. That's actually a lie. A quantum computer is a highly advanced machine that uses quantum phenomena such as super uh, superposition and entanglement to perform calculations. Let's say, for example, that you want to determine the prime factors of 5,183. Uh, a Van Newman style computer, let's call him Paul, would say, <laughs> hmm, can I divide by two, three, five, and just run through the numbers like that until we got the answer. Mr. Quan, on the other hand, the computer, not uh, not the imaginary computer, commuter, would just look at 5183 and say, obviously, it's 71 times 73. A traditional computer with n bits can only be uh, in one of two arrow or carrot in states at once but a quantum computer with in qu uh, qubits can be up to two carrot in states simultaneously I this means a quantum I think it's supposed to be two to the end like an exponent oh but they didn't have exponents in okay. the font maybe this means a quantum computer can complete the calculations that are currently impossible that's amazing mr quan are you seeing anybody these memos are weird. Also, this text looks very awful against this background. That's that's yeah, it's terrible background. Like the contrast. Could you at least put like a like a hexagon? Yeah. Could you at least put like a black hexagons. outline or just I don't know, fade out the hexagons a little bit more? Or I might just start shedding. I might just start shedding hexagons every now and then when I see them. It starts like giving it's me. It's not commoner jointing, but yeah. just the aesthetic. <laughs> Someone has written two milkmen go comedy on the wall in the warehouse of floor A. Presumably, it refers to a pair of milkmen visiting a comedy club. The sentence construction, however, is obviously wrong. There must be a reason why. Two, two milkmen, milkmen go comedy. Wait. Two milkmen go comedy? Hmm. Interesting. That's probably the one clue, right? Yeah. Although maybe, I don't know. I think a clue is hiding somewhere in here. This was secret, so I think, yeah, I think we got all of that from getting the gold. Weird. None of it was what I thought it would be. No. All right. Well, now we know things. But well, I guess we could just leave and we'll find out more. So far, we're off to a decent start with this one. I, we did now, pretty good. Now here's hoping we don't immediately have a conversation where we find out that we have a time limit and then spend uh, an hour and a half not doing anything. <laughs> <laughs> Let's avoid that if we can. Oopsie. Might want to click the key. There we go. I was oh. trying to, I was getting used to the interface. You ready? I'm gonna put in the key. <laughs> you don't need to ask me every time you're going to do something. She says that now until he does something that gets her killed. Yeah. It's like, that's a dangerous bit of, bit of permission to get given this scenario. Just hurry it up. Right, right, I know. Here goes. Stop talking and do it. Yes! It unlocked. Hmm. So now we just have to open this panel. Oh, button. Is that gonna make us fall? Let's find out. One. A two! <laughs> Once you leave the elevator, the novel section of the game will begin. Oh, boy. wait. Oh, we haven't been in the novel section yet? Well, we were before the escape room part happened. For more information. Okay. It's explaining... It's, it's, I don't know, going through a weird amount of explanation of how old video games work, which is that there's dialogue where you press A to continue. Yeah. Are you ready? Just do it. All right, all right. Message received. Here we go. Three, <laughs> two, one. Hey, push. Bonkai. Oh, wait, I forgot about that. Oh, there's a hatch in the well, that's hatch. not what I expected. Oh. It opened a uh, hatch in the ceiling? What? Why does an elevator have a ceiling hatch? Don't they all? Yeah. At least that's what I know for movies. Yeah, they do. Well, they have a maintenance hatch, yeah. <sighs> <laughs> Escaping. Hey. 